There is no reason to explain for same-sex marriage to be approved. Because after all, we are humans. We feel the same emotions. Love conquers everything. And as I stand here, and millions and thousands of people that are watching here today, including our government, please allow us to love freely. It will never hurt you. Moki ni ang tubag sa usaka kandidata sa LGBTQ pageant nga Miss Mandirigma Philippines 2022 nga gipahigayon sa General Santos City ni Adtong October 8, 2022. Siya taga Davao City. Ato siyang ilailahon karong buntaga sa Spotlight. Good morning mga kapuso! Nata din ikaroon sa People's Park sa Davao City. O syempre, makauban na ito karong buntaga si Miss Mandirigma Pride 2022. Si Miss Jason Ramos. Hello, kumusta Miss Jason? Hi, Jandy. Hi sa tanang mga Davaoenyon. Okay, una-una Miss Jason, no? congratulations. Kay nauli ganyan mo ang title ng Miss Mandirigma Pride 2022. And you are a pride din he sa Davao City. Curious me, kanus aba nagsugod ang imong hilig sa pageant? Nag-start siya at the age of 15 and now I'm 29 and started in the year 2010. So I guess I've been doing this for 12 years already. And nag-start ng akong interest for pageant when I watch a community pageant back when I was still young and then na entice ko to join after kay I see myself on the stage. Let's talk about Mandirigma pageant. What's the kalahian ni ini nga pageant compared to sa mga laing pageant? The pageant itself was um, very intriguing, especially the title itself, Mandirigma, which is, we always think as Mandirigma as someone who is masculine, someone who is always um, on the go for battle, but it's different because Miss Mandirigma Philippines represents the trans women of today, which is, from the very beginning, we were already warriors of equality. So the, the title Mandirigma is to portray that being feminine can also be very beautiful and strong. So we lobby different types of advocacy. That's why we are, um, we are warriors already with the different fights that we would lobby in, in whatever, um, in whatever um, advocacy we have as contestants. So every one of us can be a mandirigma, True. and even trans women can be a mandirigma, yes. ba? In our own ways. True. In your journey sa mandirigma, unsa ba ang mga hagit, no? Mga pagsulay, challenges na you encounter, and how do you surpass that? Actually, in Miss Mandirigma, um, there are a lot of expectations, especially um, me as um, as a pagentera. People always expect that. I would give out my best. But given that we are already 30 beautiful ladies with different advocacies, it's really hard to pinpoint who among those ladies will shine on that night. So the, the challenge is how will you make a mark on the judges and on the audience? So what I did was to let my personality shine and I pick, I see candidates, and I always observe my, my competitors so that on the day of the pageant, they would see me as a laid-back or someone who will not uh, vie for the crown. But in the end, I go for the final route, which is to, to win it. <laughs> All right, Karon, being Miss Mandirigma Pride 2022, asa ka nakatuto, Karon? What is your advocacy? My advocacy is about um, to stop gender-biased employment. I am a teacher by profession, and I, I, I dream to be teaching in elementary level. But because of the restrictions from our um, uh, from the Department of Education, I cannot practice my my profession as a trans woman because I still need to abide on the 
um, the code of ethics for professionals, for professional teachers, especially in the elementary level. Mm -hmm. So I advocate for fairness of um, in terms of employment, whether to become a teacher, to become a flight attendant, to become a doctor, or whatever fields you would wish to go through. Speaking of lesson through beauty pageant, nag viral <laughs> ang imuhang answer di ba sa, sa social media uh, platforms dili ka uh, uyon or uyon baka sa same sex marriage if 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 you were to answer it again would you, you would you give the same answer yes i would i explained it that i'm not in favor with same sex marriage but i am in favor with civil partnership or same sex same sex civil union because we are aiming for the state to recognize us legally as um, as partners or as a legally recognized partners in the state but not on the church it's different thing i respect the roman catholic church and the holy matrimony of marriage is very sacred all right naduwag ninyo to mga kapuso dili scripted wala na mo gihatag beforehand ang uh, question sa iya ha but uh, makaingon gyud tanon na she's very witty very intelligent and full of heart no kanang na, gi, gi kuan ba kinasing-kasing ang iyahang pagka beauty queen kung kinasing-kasing gyud you will never go wrong o karon mga kapuso tudluan ta niya Unsaon ba ang proper way nga sa paglakaw sa usa ka beauty queen? Ready na ba ka, Miss Jason? Ready kayo. Ah, ako sa. Let's go. Unsa ang ato ang una buhaton sa basic nga mala beauty queen na walk? Ang first is mag duck walk ta. Ang duck walk, okay, the duck walk. is that kailangan strong ang imong legs and then firm ang imong core. Ah, sige, so, firm ba gyud ni? Behind. Okay, sige go. Step then. Hala. And okay. then sway. Hui? Another step. Oni. And then sway. And then, Yo. Sway. And then sway. <laughs> okay. Hui? <laughs> Yo, duck walk. Duck walk, right? Yeah. Uh, duck walk. Mau dito ang duck walk, mga kapuso. Sige, again. Sige daw. Kaya ano na ito, Oni? so gipanihot ko sa amo ang baktas-baktas gaganiha pero well mag thank you ta kay Miss Jason Ramos ang atong Miss Mandirigma Pride 2022 Pride ng Davao City thank you kayo Miss Jason anything you wanna uh, add or message Thank you, Miss Jandy. Thank you so much to Manay Sheila Magpale, Sheila Magpale III, Attorney Jeffrey Saklot, Mama Eva Fons, and Raven Lasconia, especially sa Miss Mandirigmo Organization, Amihan Herbs, and Mami June Bertud. Thank you. All right, mga kapuso, hangtod sunod din nila sa At Home with GMA Regional TV. Bye! Kini ang At Home with GMA Regional TV.